good morning students today i am going to discuss about commonly confused words let me start the english language has several words that look alike or sound similar or sometimes look and sound alike but have completely different meanings okay students in your first semester already you had gone through such type of commonly confused words look at here homonyms actually what are homonyms here the words that have the same spelling and the same pronunciation but different meanings yes and look at here homophones here the words that have the same pronunciation but different spellings and different meanings homographs here the words that have the same spelling but different pronunciation and meanings yes it's commonly confused words so especially children commonly they get confused with alphabet b d yes instead of b they are going to write d instead of d they are going to write b especially nursery lkg ukg kids yes it's a commonly confused confused alphabet for children so in the same way in this english language some words they have the same spelling and the same pronunciation or they have the same spelling but different pronunciation and different meanings so already you had gone through all these topics in your first semester so here the topic our our today's topic that is commonly confused words here even it equates the same concept let me write it down see look at here die d i e die so what is this die so what is commonly confused word die d y e die so pronunciation same pronunciation but what different spellings and different meanings so in your textbook they had given number of examples and even they had they had given exercise 1 and exercise 2 first let me go through this whatever the they had given in the textbook look at here one next one beside beside and what is the next one besides commonly confused words here i am going to write commonly confused words next break break look at here break break see same pronunciation different spelling different meanings look at here next you know what is the meaning of break it's a break up something break what even you know what is this b r a k e what is that car break okay the driver did not use the brake to stop the car what is this break taking a break t break yes that is called break b r e a k break so at that time we are going to use the word b r e a k break okay next cell cell what is this cell you know what is cell she tried to sell her old phone s c e l l cell what is c e l l cell it is our cell phone or mobile whatever she forgot her cell phone on the table next little a little little a little so it's there is a lot of difference little a little so what is the difference here a little a few what it mean it says that something a little something is there 
only little without without an article a so what is the meaning of little nothing it's a negative version it's a positive version okay a few a little next here here let me write it out here here look at here here we know listening here here guess it's nearby okay next here 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 look at these words same pronunciation here what is the meaning of this hair it's lawful what is this hair it's property talking about property yes someone who is who owns the property something he is a he is a he is a property owner and what is hair you know what is this hair okay just simply i'm saying hair 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 same pronunciation so got it h e i r hair that is lawful h e r e hair next one h a i r hair next coming to next point next word stationery stationery you know the spellings of stationery and stationery look at here stationery yes stationery okay so here a r y here e r y so but the pronunciation stationery and stationery so what is the meaning of this it is not moving not moving it's a stagnant one stationery means what is that not moving what is this stationery we know what is this shops selling books stationery shops that is book shops stationery stationery okay a r y e r y so lots of difference is there now next to coming to tail and tail look at here tail tail look at here we know what is tail if even new people know what is tail and what is this tail it's a story something okay it's a play next to coming to current current we know what is this current current so what's the difference here you people know what is current and what is this dried grapes that is dried fruit grape fruit current okay next before in front of so before we get confused whether to use before or in front of commonly confused words in front of next complement complement look at here
Okay. Just go through this spellings. Okay. Now next 